about this concert? Uh, first heard of it in a roundabout way from Fred Mandel, who's our old keyboard player who now plays for Elton John. Mm -hmm. And we said, well, maybe, you know, maybe it could happen. And then Geldof came over and talked to us at uh, an awards dinner and we said, will we do it? And we said, yeah. And then it just gradually got confirmed on the phone. Because originally we were planning to do a concert here, actually, strangely enough, but we decided this was kind of more, it's more important, really. Was it hard to set up for you? Did you have to travel and did you have a lot of... Uh, not for us, actually. For a lot of our crew, we had to fly some of the crew in who were, like, indispensable to us. And our keyboard player, who's, uh, who's in the Bahamas. <laughs> but uh, we were all here, we're all ready, you know. It's fine. What, what, what do you think the day's been like? It's nearly finished now. I'm amazed, actually. I think it's really better than anyone could have hoped for, without wishing to, you know, gush over too much about it. I think it's great. Everything that you could have hoped for, really. Do you think the audience have been different to a normal concert? It's hard to judge because normally they're there to see one band and for us they're there to see us. So we expect everyone to go bam bam in gaga, you know. But to see everyone getting into everybody totally, it was yeah. amazing. Like They all did our stuff, they all did what they were supposed to do, you know. And uh, I think it's a very special occasion. It's totally cool knowledge of lyrics because they actually knew everyone's songs. Yeah, everyone who's there must be so devoted, you know. Yeah. And um, just a wonderfully good feeling. You know? It's great. Yeah, I'm delighted. Do you I'm, think you'll look back on it and think it was a wonderful day? Yeah, I'll probably watch the video and think, ah, why did I play those notes, you know? But why I think, was I wearing that shirt? Yeah, yeah exactly. But I mean, the excuse is, I mean, it, there's so much adrenaline. You don't play your normal way, but you give something better and something unusual. And, and I think everybody came off going, oh, God, I played a terrible beginning of so-and-so or end of so-and-so, you know, but it doesn't matter. And what did you think about only doing 20 minutes? Nice. <laughs> More of that. Uh, actually, seriously, it's a problem because it takes that long to get into hearing the sound and everything. You know. So a little longer than 20 minutes is helpful, especially when you haven't had a sound check. Yeah. <laughs> but who cares? And what are you going to do the rest of the evening? Um, we have another thing to do. I'm going to go on with Freddie at uh, the end, just before McCartney does his uh, Let's It Be. We're doing the work we created. And then... Um, He's very, Freddie's very nervous, he said, about doing that. I've been nervous all day, which is unusual. I think everybody has. Yeah, they have. Everyone's such it's just such an nervous. unknown quantity. You walk on that stage and you have no idea what's going to happen. It's not your familiar surroundings. You know. but, um, and then I think we're going to go to Legends to see all the stars, man. And see all the Americans. <laughs> I'll have a drink. I think I need a drink after this. <laughs> yeah. Thanks a lot. Thank you.